A sweet melody entwined in a blanket of trees welcomes visitors to a treasure inside Tanglewood Park. Nestled in the shade high on the hill sits the manor house. To have a bed and breakfast inside of an 1100 acre park is really special. So special we found several newspaper articles about this estate built in 1859 by James Johnson. He built it for his daughter Emily as a wedding gift. You know, no big deal, just, just a house. Congratulations, <laughs> yep. At that time it had 18 rooms. But before it was built in 1859, the owner, William Johnson, built something unique a few yards away. So it was actually a fort overlooking the Yadkin River, which is uh, right over there. And it was built to protect him and his family and his neighbors from attack during the French and Indian War. A marker now sits in its place, but the manor house remains with its restored Victorian era rooms, antique furniture, and crystal chandeliers throughout the estate, which was sold to William Neal Reynolds, brother of R.J. Reynolds in 1921. People enjoy kind of coming in and staying where a family would have stayed many years ago and for that family to be a part of the Reynolds, uh, one of the Reynolds families, is really special to people not only in this area um, but across the country. Something that's also very unique about the manor house is the trophy room which we're inside right now. Take a look at this, a little bit of family history here. Did you know that William Reynolds absolutely loved horses? He did everything from raising them to racing them and even won trophies for them. We do have hotels in the area, but to have um, just a, another option that isn't kind of cookie cutter, that's special to this area as well, I think is a big deal.